parsec error 1403 is often encountered due to issues with graphics settings, display configurations, or system level conflicts. If you are using a laptop, the most common reason for this error is that Parsec is using the wrong GPU. While it may default to your dedicated NVIDIA or AMD graphics card, Parsec actually needs to use your Intel or AMD CPU's integrated graphics for compatibility reasons. You can fix this by adjusting your laptop's graphics settings to force Parsec to run using the integrated GPU. Another possible cause is the game running in full screen mode. Certain games don't correctly report their resolution to Windows when in full screen which can cause errors with Parsec. To avoid this, try setting the game to windowed mode or borderless full screen. If your guest users are getting kicked out during login, permission prompts or user account control pop-ups, it may be due to Windows system service conflicts. In these cases, you'll need to look into repairing Parsec's system level permissions and services. Error can also occur if your host PC doesn't have a physical monitor attached, you're using a virtual machine, or you've turned off the monitor. Parsec requires the GPU to detect an active display. You can work around this by enabling Parsec's virtual display in the host settings, which is automatically activated in the free version when no physical monitor is detected. Alternatively, you can use an HDMI dummy plug to simulate a display being connected. Just be aware that using such a dongle will make the monitor output invisible on the host machine while it's plugged in. If you're working on a multi-user Windows system, remember that Parsec cannot support multiple simultaneous logins. If one user logs in while another is still active via switch user, it can cause this error. Make sure all other users are fully logged out before a new session begins. In team environments, administrators often create group policies to automatically log users out after a period of inactivity. Finally, if you use Windows Remote Desktop RDP, you might be triggering a conflict with Parsec. While both can technically run together, performance suffers and error can appear. If you're on Windows 10 build 1903 or later, Parsec may conflict with the WDDM graphics mode used by RDP. To resolve this, open the Group Policy Editor Go to Local Computer Policy, then Computer Configuration, then Administrative Templates, then Windows Components, then Remote Desktop Services, then Remote Desktop Session Host, then Remote Session Environment, and Disable, use WDDM Graphics Display Driver. Following these steps should help you eliminate Parsec Error 1403 and restore a stable remote connection.